Most of what we have here uh, is lab-made crystals that weren't intended for jewelry. Uh, they were intended for science, medicine, and industry. Uh, we are repurposing, or I think the trendy term is now upcycling them for the gem trade. So we have uh, laser crystals, like laser alexandrite, which has actually been retired after a long time of service. You can see the crater on the end from when it uh, uh, had, was driven too long and too fast and exploded a little bit. Uh, we give this material a nice retirement as gemstones. Uh, we also have... This is also synthetic? This is also synthetic. This is a iron doped lithium niobate. It was cut by my good friend Eric, House of Siwas. And he uh, did a fantastic job. This material is currently being researched by Microsoft for use in hologram data storage. Yes, sir. Uh, these are our scintillator crystals. These are designed to detect invisible radiation. Basically, when you are making a camera to pick up x-rays, it's hard to detect them directly. Okay. So what they do is make a pixel like this, and then when radiation hits it, it glows. And the camera can pick up with a glow right here, and that's how they make digital x-ray machines. They do a similar thing with PET scanners and CAT scanners. Excellent. Thank you, sir. What's your name, sir? I'm Tim Challoner. My company is Turtle Sport. Got our card right here if you want to see it.